Capricorns, who's this male? Friend, ex, ex-husband, father of your children, baby daddy, family. Could be an Aries or a Virgo, heavy water here. That is leaning on the past that you all had in an effort to restart something with you, come back in the picture, keep the lines of communication open. After a period of being away, no communication separate and heavy on the being away, right? We see the hermit here, which speaks to a separation and isolation. And then this three of wands, being at a distance, waiting for something to come in. Mm. Some of y'all dealing with an Aquarius here with the star. Could even be a Libra with that six of pentacles. But uh, somebody that's been away or you've been away from, heavily leaning on this past. Remember when? Nostalgia. And that's why I'm getting X, the X vibes or getting an old friend. Because this is somebody that you're not expecting to hear from. More of that Aries Scorpio energy with this tower, like out of the blue, kind of, and again, given the vibes with this Emperor and the Six of Cups, like just expecting things to, you know, pick up where they left off. Capricorns, welcome and welcome back to my channel. This is Down to Earth Tarot. Please hit the like button, subscribe, and let me know where you're watching from. Capricorns, please drop your sign in the sign of this person down below. It's the long time no see, coming in, showing mad love. Some of you coming in with a romantic offer. Again, the X vibes with the Six of Cups and the Emperor. Mm. Ace of Cups, Nine of Wands, Hermit. Huh? Mm. Mm -mm -mm. And that star staying in the, the bottom of the deck. <clears throat> which lets us know Capricorns and cross watchers that this person has been watching, waiting for the right time to approach you, to reach out, send that text message or that DM or to roll up on you. And it does give the X vibes with this Knight of Wands. Mm. Somebody that maybe had many options or is treating you like an option. Oh. Some of you, it might be a couple of people coming back playing this the same way, the same card here with these multiple nights. And this Queen of Wands, as we've been seeing lately, at least <clears throat> on my channel, uh, some of y'all looking good. Your physical appearance drawing some people back, wanting people to, <clears throat> getting people feeling like they should spin the block on you and see, you know, what it's really hidden for. Clarifying. into this knight of swords because i do for some of you capricorns again these physical appearances <clears throat> doing what they're supposed to do some of y'all have these multiple people coming back this mm. oh now somebody's single but again that nine of pentacles looking together being rewarded see some of y'all are getting some acknowledgement publicly so it's not just that you look good on Instagram or Facebook, but somebody's been hearing about you and your success. Mm. Could also be that somebody's single out of a relationship. Oh, they talking about a relationship now. Ten of Pentacles and this nine here. Mm, mm, mm. Some of you indeed dealing with a Virgo or another earth sign person. But somebody trying to rush in and lock you down now that they're single, seeing that you're single and you have this history together. Mm. This person, air sign, earth sign, could be somebody who's very financially stable. You see Virgo, Capricorn with that Ten of Pentacles. Mm. There's competition over you, uh, Capricorns. Multiple people want to get into this number one spot. The Seven of Cups again. Mm. 
Do you really want to mess with somebody who felt like you didn't have any options up until now? Isn't that interesting? Mm. Mm -mm -mm. And again, this who's this air sign person that felt like you couldn't do any better? My goodness. But this person we feel like is financially stable, single. Now I want to talk about something permanent, a relationship, commitment with this Ten of Pentacles, and leaning on this history that you have. Again, somebody could even be coming and bearing gifts. But this Seven of Cups, when they're talking about a commitment, what type of commitment are they talking? Or is it still up in the air? Again, that Seven of Cups is like, mm, something not quite being right, illusion, deception. And then we see the magician here. Mm. More of that Aries, Gemini vibes with this magician. Somebody being very crafty. Who's this Knight of Wands that's looking to come back? Mm. Likes attention. Likes to be the center of the center of attention. And can be very crafty. Maybe they work with their hands. Or maybe they're just heavy on the being deceptive. Look at this magician coming in, bearing gifts, talking about blessings, mm, giving somebody what they want. And again, you're having a history with this person. Mm, giving me the water. Oh. Now this gives me the vibes of somebody who's been on again, off again with this eight of swords. They're stuck on you, you stuck on them. Mm, could be a little toxic. Some of y'all dealing with the Capricorn. Others of you <clears throat> could be dealing with the Cancer um, on the opposite side. But it, there could be a long distance thing between you and this person. And that could also be that on again, off again. Also, if somebody lives at a distance, that could be that needing attention on again, off again. I mean, out of sight, out of mind. But also this element of somebody having vices or manipulation and or control with that devil. And this, who's very focused on status or a workaholic? And that's the reason why things are on again, off again, again. Maybe they hit you up when they're in town or vice versa. But now they're trying to talk about something more, ooh, now they're trying to talk about something more serious. We see the Empress. You see this Ace of Pentacles. Uh-oh. Talking about something real serious. Deep-rooted feelings, Capricorn. Mmm. Mmm. Interesting. A couple of people that you have this history with. Coming, coming on strong. Somebody definitely coming in wanting to see where a situation can go. Who is this person that's older? King of Pentacles. 10, 15, 30 plus years. There's somebody that's talking about marriage. Not just the history that you have. <clears throat> make be, becoming somebody's boyfriend or girlfriend. There's somebody wanting to take things seriously again. And I don't want to say it's because of somebody's physical appearances really has somebody wanting to commit, but I, I feel like there's been a major change in somebody's physical appearance and that's got all different types of new doors opening up for some of these old people. Who's the Libra that sees you working hard? Again, at looking good. Mm. Shout out to the people that are bodybuilding. <clears throat> or even working in the beauty industry. But this is somebody, get, the spin in the block, having a history with this person, talking about just going to the courthouse and doing something real quick. I almost feel like for some of you, this is somebody that you work with. But again, also this person being very physically attractive as well. 
even with them being, I feel like, significantly older with this King of Pentacles. Somebody's keeping it together. And again, it looks like none of these options are broke. That's the good news, Capricorn. And somebody's serious. The Six of Wands. Somebody is talking about, again, making something official, putting something out there. Taking a, taking a leap of faith. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Whatever this time apart was, and somebody getting it, look, apparently physically all the way together, getting themselves together and coming through with this confidence has given somebody the clarity that they need to want to go, go all in in a situation. Go all in on a situation and definitely given the vibes of somebody that they were sleeping on. Yeah. Sleeping on. We see the Six of Pentacles. I feel like I feel like some of you know are leaning towards this person that struggles with work-life balance. Again, this person very focused on status, money, this workaholic. But then there's also some of you that's, you know, dealing with this player here in the middle. And wondering if something is really serious or if this is somebody just wanting to get back in your good graces and keeping the lines of communication open with that six of pentacles and the six of swords. There's a definite need to pay attention to somebody's actions, you know, versus their words, what somebody's showing you versus what they're telling you, Capricorns, when they when they come through. Yeah. Judge them by their actions, not just their words. Right? Because this person, because they're already familiar, they know exactly what to say to make you comfortable here with the four swords. Mm. But judge them not on their words, but by their actions, family. And we see it here. Some. Somebody still wants to be in the streets. Somebody's here just to, you know, test the, test the temperature. See if you're still sipping the Kool-Aid here with the Ace of Cups. Seeing, you know, if they're t it's looking to see if their text messages are still going through. If you block them on the World Wide Web. If they can still see you when they're back in town. If you're willing to come and see them when you're back in town. Mm, mm, mm. But you have multiple people here. Multiple people that feel like they fumbled you. Fumbled this situation. And now there's all this potential wanting to reconcile. As we're getting ready to go to the pumpkin patch today. I don't really want to go, family. I don't want to go. Now they want to go to the pumpkin patch. Now they want to spend Halloween together. Oh, aren't we... They want to meet your family for Thanksgiving. Is that right? Pay attention to these people's actions as they're wanting to come around. Mm -hmm. It's the actions as they're wanting to come back around. Yeah. Tail between their legs. Mm. And that's probably not all, fam. Wanting to rekindle a situation. Watch out because, you know, the liar, the cheater, the thief, the person that's betrayed you once, they may do it again. And notice all these tens and the red. Pay attention to the red flag. Yeah. Who's this go with the flow person? Flip flopping, but talking about something serious. Watch out for the he or she who likes Captain Morgan. Drinking a little too much. The drunk dialing. Mm. Capricorn, you have a few people coming at you after they've seen you looking good, experienced the new confident you. But what again? Watch out for this person just talking about commitment. Just to play games here. Capricorns, drop this person sign and your person sign down below. 
Let me know it resonated for you. Hit the like button, subscribe, check out my other content and Capricorns. I'll be tapping in soon. I'll be tapping in with you a little bit later today. Keep it real.